Sally made me do it. She said it's good for me heart. Right. She also said it's important that nobody upsets me in case I have another funny turn. Heart attack? Yeah, whatever. The only person in danger of having heart attack is Steve when I wring his scrawny neck. Why? What's he done now? He's only threatening to chuck me out on the street. Probably under a bus while he's at it. No, Steve wouldn't do that. Oh, yeah, he would if Tracy put him up to it. Well, that's a pain. Hey, do you think you could get me to chuck Sally out? All right, maybe not. So, where is he? He took a daily lunch. Right, well, will you tell him I want a word? But now? Yeah, now. Unless you want the whole street knowing about your little... Nope. ...yoga session. Right, look, I promise you, if you let me go, I won't say anything. I, I, I swear, I'll tell him I never saw your face. Oh, well, I'm supposed to take your word for that. Well, yeah, because you can trust me. Look, I've been inside, haven't I? I won't wish that on my worst enemy. <laughs> Just shut up. I need time to think. Yeah. Yeah, good idea. Take your time, because we're all friends here. Just... Don't time I said shut it! Steve, you there, mate? Your mum was here, and I think she'd like a word. Too right I want a word. When Even think about it, and you're dead. Kicking me out on the street. Against the wall. Now. On your knees. Huh? Do it. Can you please talk about this? <laughs> Talking's all you've done. Look, I've got kids. Okay? Look, look, listen. Yeah? Yeah, look. This is Amy. This is Oliver. He's barely even two. Give me your phone. Shut your eyes. Hey? Shut them! Oh, please, I'm begging you. Not for me, but for me kids. <laughs> oh, you listen to me. I know people, all right? People are way scarier than me. So if you even breathe a word of this, even talk about it in your sleep, it won't just be you they come after. It'll be your mum. And then Amy. And then little Oliver. Do you get me? Do you get me? Yes, yes, I get you. Good. Now keep your eyes shut. What are you gonna do? Hello? Then. Yeah, well, thank you, Steve, for leaving me to deal with your mam. I do realise she's hopping mad with you. Yeah, of course you do. That's why you disappeared. Oh, well, great. Just carry on ignoring me. What did I say to you about picking up random punters? Eh? I said I could get into trouble, didn't I? I said I shouldn't risk it. But would you listen? No! Well, I hope you're happy now, Tracy. Happy now? Steve, I, what are you on? I about? have just been hijacked by some psychopath armed robber with a knife. And all because you thought it was a good idea to pick up strangers at the side of the road. 